Today I will be showing you what happens to a collapsed arch. Uh, there are collapsed arches and there are also flat feet. Uh, flat feet are feet that are already flat and when they stand up it may or may not collapse a little bit. But there are some arches that are a normal arch when you're sitting and then when you stand up or walk the arch can collapse as well. So I'm going to show you that type of arch today. Uh, which actually happens to be on my arch. So you'll be seeing how my feet move today. First, we will stop at the back of my heels. My left foot does collapse more than my right. And you can see that on the left foot because the toes are pointing out. So you can see that four of my toes on the left foot, uh, or since you can't see any toes on the right. So my left foot does collapse in more. That collapse can be coming from higher up, pushing everything in, or it could be coming from the foot. When the foot collapses in, the toes naturally will point out, and that's what, why you can see the toes pointing outwards. You can also see that the ankle is rolling in more on the left foot. So you see that ankle bone is more prominent on the inside of the left versus on the right side. So let's take a look at the foot while it's walking. So as you can see, the, when the left foot strikes down, there's that collapse on the inside. It's, it's a little bit more curved in on the right left side. Uh, right side looks a little bit better. There is a collapse through the arch. It might be harder to see here, but we can see it on, in the next frame that I will show. And there's a little bit less collapse. Well, there's less collapse at the heel. It's a, little, a lot more straighter on that right side. So let's take a look while I'm walking towards the camera. So same idea. You can see that the right foot doesn't collapse as much. There's, it's a little bit straighter, but there is a little bit of curve in. There is some collapse on that right side. The left, you can see a little bit more prominent. There's a lot more collapse through the left one, and it really bulges inwards. So there's that more of a curve inwards on that left side. Now looking from the side angle, you can see how the foot collapses in. So this is the left one. So as the foot drops down, you can see how it collapses. And then as we're pushing through, or it collapses even farther as we're going through the motion. And then on the right foot, a little bit less, you can still see the collapse under the urge, but more of the collapse that you can see on the left is more from the front and the back. So that's a little bit more about my feet. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out and I would be happy to help.